Regicide! Suicide! Hello you gorgeous souls, my name is Aeroshot and today we're playing some re 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 Regicide Regicide on Halo 4 uh, If you don't know, which probably you don't, Halo 4 came out November 6th and if you didn't know that you probably live under a rock uh, But anyways, Regicide is a game type where it is free for all but basically there's one superhuman super freak who becomes a king and this guy gets super powerful and he gets more points for every kill he gets so what the goal is you first basically you have to hit 300 points in the total right now i'm at 45 and you can get these points either by killing the man who is titled as the king or you can just kill everyone else who comes your way but killing the king gets you more points and being the king gets you more points so basically the focus of the game type is around the king but um you know, you can't just win just going around killing other people, but I like killing the king because I want to be Julius Caesar. So, uh, for the most part, I'm the king this game, and that's how I win so fast. And I kind of joined the game a little bit late, but I don't think it mattered too much, and it's still an exciting game. Anyways, guys, I had this thing in my head that I knew I was supposed to... Oh, okay, yeah, I know what I'm going to talk about now. Um, basically, I noticed something in sports in gaming in pretty much everything uh school you name it there's a little phenomenon going oh this guy gets demolished what was he doing and this guy i try to demolish and oh oh where am i where am i oh he's running away and i got him and i try to i think i get killed right here oh no no i'm not getting killed yet get a yard and then i get smacked in the back so that's not cool but i noticed something which is kind of just like a phenomena of the world a phenomenon phenomenon of the world and it's kind of it's it's kind of weird that the world works this way but anyways you guys ever notice that the best at something are always the ones practicing more and uh, let, let me elaborate on this for example um you have the super nerd of your class 4.2700 gpa i mean that's not that high four point let's say eight gpa and this guy is like a beast, aces every single test. But guess what, you know who's the one who's sitting back? You know who the one is who's spending long hours grinding through it at the night? Okay, that sounded kind of dirty, but <laughs> just studying, just reading the book, two hours, like 12 in the morning. And this guy, or 12 at midnight, and this guy's just spending so much time trying to get perfect at his like, school at his quiz or at the subject that he's learning and i find it i find it weird that the people who need the least practice do the most and that's why they become the best um for example here's another example uh usually when uh i follow the lakers on twitter or the lakers reporter whatever um and this guy is like always in and around the lakers basically the lakers personal paparazzi and guess who Who's the player who's spending the most time out in the gym after practice putting up shots and stuff? Yup, you guessed it, Kobe Bryant. And now, naturally you'd be like, okay, shouldn't someone like Luke Walton, if you smell the Lakers, be the one trying to practice and stuff? But no, it's Kobe Bryant, um, arguably the best in the NBA, or a future Hall of Famer, obviously. And you know, this guy's a beast, you can't deny it. If you don't like him, I don't care, You, he's a beast. I don't like LeBron. Um, he's a beast, okay, just get that out of the way, but, you know, this guy who's like the best in the freaking NBA right now at shooting, at just shooting, this guy is the number one guy who's in the gym practicing his shot, and I find it hard to believe, like, if you're so good, why do you need practice, but the thing is, practice is what makes you that good and what keeps you that good, um, and why am I bringing this up, well, um, I find that me and my brother are playing this game more so than people who need to play the game and need to get better And it's weird cuz like you know how you know that saying the rich get richer It's in full effect because the rich usually aren't the lazy ones um, or In this case in terms of halo like some people are like oh I want to get good so bad and then they're just Freaking I don't know what they're doing. They're just not even playing like okay if you want to get good you got to play this, you know, know what I'm saying, son? It ain't gonna come easy in the hood, homie G. And, uh, yeah, so I pick up my overshield. I, you get some weird friends with benefits sort of 
health stuff. Oh, this guy just runs right into my nade, so I stopped shooting him. You get some weird power-ups when you become the king. And uh, I just pick up a random overshield right there, which was kind of cool. And uh, last guy right here, he runs right into my pulse grenade. Take him out, and I'm one away from the final kill. What do I do? I'm getting shot at. Oh, oh, are you trying to kill me, son? Get six-shotted with my magnum. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and let me know what you think. Thank you so much for watching, and thank you for your support. My name is Aeroshot, and I am over and out.